here uh, from jazzeveryone.com with some YouTube action on my new Making Music mini-series. Anyone that's worked with my Jazz Everyone language system knows how much easier it is to play and hear the chord changes with the pentatonic pairs guiding the way. They work like GPS in your car. They help you play from measure to measure through all of the chord changes without fail. However, you will need some other things to round out your playing, like scales, broken scales, chord tones, blues, good time, a good sound, and a sense of how to phrase and put it all together. My Making Music mini-series will show you how easy it is to add these things to your playing in three simple tunes I introduce in the six-pack. Um... I'll do this now in three parts or levels with one of those tunes, on the trail, or as I call it, trailing on. I've also done this for Satin Doll and Tune Up in the Making Music mini-series, but you'll have to visit the website to see and hear those. Here's the process. It starts with learning to make music with just the notes in the two major scales in On the Trail. And that's F major and G flat major. Here's a taste of that. Two, three, four. <laughs> some broken chords for vocabulary, okay? or chord tones in the scales help me make even more interesting melodies. good stuff in a pot with the pentatonic pairs with that major third added and voila I'll be making some pretty good music with this vocabulary when I play with good time and a good sound <laughs>
In part two, or level two, I'm going to expand my vocabulary by putting the chromatics that embellish and connect the pentatonic players in place. And I'll do this with some help from my chromatic drill exercises. Here's a sample. <laughs> pair setups on the flat seventh of the dominant seventh introduced in lesson six of the six pack is another key component in making music with the bebop scale and putting those chromatics in the right place that's a real challenge uh, and it's one that uh, doesn't come all of that easy <laughs> some pretty good basic bebop if I do say so myself. Here it is. <laughs> the diminished scales, show you how to use them with the pentatonic pair setups on the flat seven. Uh, this will make it easier for you to find the right place to start your diminished patterns as you move them up and down the diminished ladders. Believe me, this makes all of your playing much more interesting when you're making music. <laughs> again now uh, with some scales, chord tones, blues, pentatonic pairs, diminished uh, vocabulary, and I'm going to make a whole lot of music. So come to my Jazz Everyone website and check it out. You'll be glad you did and so will all the people that listen to you play. <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you.